Hey everyone, we just got back from one of Daisy's brunches and it was sufficiently awkward. No it wasn't. Today's the day I've been waiting for for so long, my friend. I think she's finally going to say it. She's just having a little bit of a tough time doing so. Well then, would you care to share with everyone what you mean by that? Of course I would. So we all sit down and we start talking. And I can just tell that Daisy is ready. She's ready to tell Tom that she never loved him. But I wanted to make it easy on her, give her some more time to, you know, collect herself. So I stirred the conversation in a different way. But Tom, Tom, I think he's caught on to us. I really am surprised that he's caught on to us. You know, I didn't, I didn't peg him as someone that smart. But he's caught on to us. And he's decided to make it his primary objective to make it as hard as possible for Daisy to tell him that she never loved him. But you know what? Enough is enough. I just see the way he controls her. It's like she's a slave. He tells her what to do. He tells her what to say. He basically controls her life. And naturally, I got angry. I got really angry at that. And you know, Tom, in typical Tom fashion, decided to chicken out. And said, hey, let's spend a day at the city. And that's how we got here. Yeah, but you're forgetting the part where Daisy thought it would be a good idea to go to the city. <laughs> My friend, you fail to recognize how much of a leash he has on her. She doesn't even know. Or it could be all she knows. Nick, you don't even understand how much time I've been spending with this girl. You're right, I don't. We've been talking about our future together. That old feeling that we used to just share so strongly is coming back even stronger. Words can't even describe how happy I've been these past few weeks. She loves me, Nick, <laughs> and I know it. She's gonna tell Tom that she never loved him. Well, what if she doesn't? I'll help her. Today, in fact, when we go to the city, she's gonna tell Tom that she never loved him. Anyways, I'm gonna go grab my car. You mean to give you a ride back to Tom's? Sure, just let me finish up here. Guys, what am I doing? Today is a mess. I don't know what Gatsby and Tom are trying to prove by putting Daisy under all this pressure. But the sad thing is, is that they both love her and they don't even realize that they're doing this. No, you know, the saddest thing is, is that I'm stuck in the middle of all of it. God. What is happening to me? 